sells a million copies, the, the B-side goes along for a ride, <laughs> which is a wonderful thing. I, um, well, the, the other one is Grandma Got Run Over by a Reindeer, but, but, but this one, after, uh, after Grandma had been out for, for a couple of years and was doing really well, I got a call from Elmo and Patsy, the people who had recorded it, and they said, this thing's going so well, we're going to do a whole album with Grandma as the title cut on it, do you have any other Christmas songs that we might consider? And I said, no, but could I call you back in 20 minutes? Because I wasn't going to miss a chance, you know, to have another, another record out. And I didn't know it was going to turn out to be the, the backside of the single when, uh, when it was released on a major label. But I also, I wanted to write a song that was kid-friendly because Grandma was never intended to be heard by kids. I wrote that to sing to drunks in a bar. <laughs> and things just happened. So I thought, what hasn't been written about at Christmas time? You know, that we've already got Santa Claus and Christmas trees and reindeer and a poinsettia was the only thing that I could think of. So I said, let's do this. Okay, kid song, Charlie Brown kind of song. Um, how about a poor little poinsettia that's all wilted and nobody wants to buy it and it's the last one left on the shelf at Christmas time. And so that's where we came up with Percy the Puny Poinsettia. And, <laughs> and you will never before or since hear it like you're going to hear it right now. <laughs> Percy the Puny Poinsettia Hanging his bloom in dismay If they had just kept him wetter He'd be a houseplant today Folks like the other plants better Now he's alone on the shelf Even plant with no uncle or aunt Shouldn't spend Christmas Day by himself Holiday shoppers would stop at the counter and pick out a plant to take home. One at a time, all his friends were adopted till Percy was left all alone. Percy, the puny poinsettia, hanging his bloom in dismay. If they had just kept him wet, he'd be a houseplant today. Say there's no such thing as Santa But as for me and Grandpa, we believe She'd been drinking too much eggnog And we begged her not to go But she forgot her medication So she staggered out the door into the snow When we found her Christmas morning scene of the attack. She had hook prints on her forehead and incriminating claws marks on her back. 
round of applause, Mr. Randy Brooks! <laughs> On a cold winter night, when it's snowing outside, and the family gathers at home, voices ring, children sing, all their favorite cows of bold. In the streets, hand in hand, still a kiss when they can, lovers stroll through a white wonderland. Stars above were made for love, and the Christmas lights show them the way. So I'll be home for Christmas. My friends will all be there. The Christmas tree and the family. I hope. of the town, all is still not a sound, now the children are home snug in bed, you and I by the fire's side, as the glow from the cold slowly fades, so I'll be home for Christmas, my friends will all be there, the Christmas tree and the family I hope that you'll be there so I'll be home for Christmas my friends will all be there the Christmas tree and the family I hope Home is a lot of things. Home is the people you're with. Maybe, I mean, there's a Billy Joel song. I, I think somebody up here knows a few Billy Joel songs. <laughs> like about how you're my home, and I'm lucky that my wife is, she helps me provide in that song. And we just celebrated our birthdays yesterday. And um, we bought each other a birthday present. Um, Paul and I are the newest residents of a town called New Braunfels, Texas. So, I think we all should learn how to sing this. We should make sure that we know that there's only one S in New Braunfels. Can, can you help me sing this song, my love? How does this song go? There's only one S in New Braunfels. You'll find it right at the end.
also very blessed that marrying Paula, I got to marry into an amazing family. And many of the Adams family are... It is not that Adams family. <laughs> Right now, I'd like to bring my brother-in-law up here on stage, Mr. Michael Adams. <laughs> Michael is an amazing singer, and um, he's a lyric baritone. And so he is one of he is one of the most amazing opera singers on the planet. And he's going to sing a little rendition of Oh Holy Night. Now that you can see, I'm the schmuck in the family. <laughs> so Michael is a world-renowned opera singer, as well as his wife. 
Um, uh, Sister Jacqueline is a French horn professor. Mom Pam is the second flute and piccolo soloist with the Fort Worth Symphony Orchestra. Dad Bob, some of you saw him here and at Krause's, is an amazing singer and entertainer, and he's just an awesome guy. And my amazing wife, Paula, did her undergrad degree in clarinet, but decided to go into the land of music therapy, and then she's a board-certified behavioral analyst and works with kids with autism, and she does something amazing for her. So I'm very, very, very lucky. all of our friends. In fact, I would like to invite my father-in-law, who is one of the greatest singers and entertainers I know. How about a round of applause? Dad Bob's gonna come out here. Michael is coming out here. Tina Wilkins. Randy Brooks. Oma, you are singing out there and I hear the power. helping with the merchandise today, but you know, I kind of want to have my beautiful wife on stage with us. Yeah. Hello, sweetheart. We're going to sing some silver bells, everybody. City sidewalks, big city sidewalks, dressed in holiday. taught us the song and we're going to do two verses of it. Everybody, we must feel the German heritage of New Braunfels as we sing them. Oh, Tannenbaum. Oh, Tannenbaum. Oh, Tannenbaum. 
den Baum, wie drüssig sei er mit dem O Tannenbaum, O Tannenbaum, wie drüssig sei er mit dem. Du grüßt dich nur zur Zunezeit, nein auch im Winter, wenn es schneit. O Tannenbaum, O Tannenbaum, wie drüssig sei er mit dem. It has been an absolute pleasure. Thank you and hope you all have a Merry Christmas.